We've got some MLB postseason madness between the Boston Red Sox and the Tampa Bay Rays, but we're gonna highlight Nick Pavetta's insane relief appearance in extras from the 10th to the 13th inning. He gives a single up to Eros Arena, but on a 3-2 count he strikes out Kiermaier, he steals second, and he breaks for third when the fielder has the ball, but somehow he manages to stay safe because the fielder threw the ball too early and they couldn't tag him out. But it doesn't matter because he strikes out Zunino on a high fastball. Pivetta scratches his ass. Let me get this last batter out. Just kidding. Cool angle of the ball blowing past Zunino's bat. And then Pivetta gets Luplo with another knuckle curve. He's hype as fuck. And he should be. Show emotion. Look at this fan. Is he John Boy if John Boy was a Red Sox fan? Offense does nothing for another half inning and Brandon Lowe strikes out. Another knuckle curve this time inside and low. Skip Wander Franco's flyout. And we get to see Margot strike out on another knuckle curve in the dirt. I love this guy's celebration, the adrenaline release jog. And this is the most chaotic inning he pitched. Leading off with a strikeout on the high heat, I demand this camera zoom into me. And then this crazy play happens. This and the walk off are gonna be the talk of this game, but the gist of it is that Kiermaier crushes the ball to center but it lands on the warning track and bounces off Renfro's leg out of play. And the umps stand around for 10 minutes before announcing it's a ground rule double, which is important because Diaz could have easily scored if the ball was still in play, but it bounces off Renfro, which in the rule books counts as a ground rule double, almost like an anti-error, where Renfro actually helps his team by giving up the double. Anyway, back to Pivetta. He strikes out the last batter with a high fastball, pumps his chest. Now he's gotta hope that the batters do their jobs. Speaking of which, at the bottom of the 13th, with a runner on first, one out, Vasquez steps up to bat, and on the very first pitch, he nails the fastball to left field and ends the ball game with a walk-off two-run home run. Red Sox went from almost losing to a walk-off. Look at all his teammates getting ready for him to step on home plate. Boom! turns home plate into a fountain. And then the cameras are going to show the despair of the other team for some reason. Kiermaier trying to occupy himself with non-celebration. Jimin Choi planning his revenge walk-off homer in the dugout. Yankees fans trying to cope with the wild card loss are kinda mad right now. They wish they were Boston, but they're not. So yeah, Red Sox are up 2-1 to, to the Rays.